Morning. Morning. Brian. I guess I'm introducing us, so. And we're going to start right now. How about that, guys? My name is Rosie Flores. I'm proud to be here with my uh, Penguin Gretsch here. And uh, over to my right, Cindy Cash Dollar on lap steel guitars. Thank you. We got a 1955 family here. Nice. Woo. See, they last a long time. <laughs> they do. <laughs> Back behind me on the drums is Stephen Bellens. Stephen. And the very respectable and so handsomely dressed Mr. Roscoe Beck on the bass. We all live in Austin, Texas. And we're glad to be Woo! here. We're going to start with a little number called Run Chicken Run. Here we go. So this is going to be called Rosebud Blues. We have to rename this guitar here. But uh, this is one off one of my high tone records way back when. Uh, pleasure to play this version here today. January. We're killing time while she's switching gears here. Today uh, is uh, the 17th of January, 2008, right? Got it. All day long. Is everybody feeling okay out there? Yeah. Did you get enough yeah. sleep? No. No, good, good answer. That means you were partying last night and drinking, as it should be. Now parties all night long.
It's a great guitar player that I met in Los Angeles when I lived here. And then I lived in Nashville for about seven years and got to hook up with Rick Vito. I don't know if he's around, but you tell him I said hi and I'm singing a song he wrote. It's called Devil Love.
we're going to do a little driving wheel. This is a song that um, one of my favorite rockabilly singers, Robert Gordon, recorded way back when. It's called Driving Wheel. when I was maybe 16 years old in a garage. Maybe maybe you did too, huh, Roscoe? Maybe. Years back. <laughs> yeah. Jeff Beck was always one of my favorite guitar players, so this one's one that he played on. Call, I'm not talking. Here we go. Oh, oh, sorry. Should we do that anyway? Okay, I said it, so we're going to do it. Oh, but then we got to do an amp thing. Okay, never mind. I can't see my list. Jeff it might have done this song, we just don't know. <laughs> <laughs> now, this is a song that I got from, uh, let me reintroduce this song. Janice Martin was one of my favorite rockabilly artists and singers, and uh, she wrote this song when she was about 19 years old. She's up in heaven now. We lost her just a few months ago to cancer, but uh, I'd like to say that I produced her last record, and hopefully it's going to come out soon. But this is one Janice and I recorded on the Rockabilly Philly record back in 95. Just check my tuning kids for a minute. Thank you. 
going to do that Yardbird song I was talking about. This is off the Birdland record. Came out a really long time ago. Some of you guys weren't even born probably, actually. I wasn't even born then. No, just kidding. <laughs> I was born, um, I feel like 150 years ago. <laughs> a good night's sleep will help, though, I'm sure. Next year I'll get a good night's sleep. Here we go, Winter Nam 2008 version of I'm Not Talking. Ready? change amp thing change amp thing this is a song I wrote uh, um, with uh, two guys uh, Rocky Burnett son of Johnny Burnett and uh, I wrote it with who was the other guy oh John Heron wrote this song and uh, it's kind of fun to play hope you like it we're gonna leave you this our last little number here and then uh, we'll be back again to play on Saturday at 5 p.m. I'd like to thank Fender for bringing us in here. Thanks to Bill C. and everybody. Everybody has been so nice to us and helping us get set up and everything. We'll see you around. Here's one more song. Ready, guys?
Thanks a lot, everybody. Woo! Thank you.